God, I need to shave. But anyways, uh, hey guys. I'm not really going to cut this because I want to be genuine with you. I don't really want to edit this. So, the video might be a bit draggy. It's been a while. And... You know that this video is quite serious now because you don't really see an uh, intro or other. But I'll go straight to the point now. But right, I'm supposed to post a video about me preparing for a football trial that I have managed to receive. And it was in last month, November. Probably November 2nd, where I got notified of the trials. And I started preparing for it and started making a YouTube video for it. About my trainings, what I do. I want to do what I eat, what I do, and what I treat myself, how I treat myself, my lifestyle, when I sleep, but that was a bit of a stretch, maybe it was a bit too far-fetched for me, but nevertheless, I mean if you look at my channel now, that video still isn't up, but there is a good reason why, which is, I frankly do not have the strength to edit this video. This last month, right, of November, has been a very, very challenging November for me. Because not only did the trials test my discipline and my ability to train, my mental, but life did test me as well because there's so many things in my life that was happening at the same time as that. It's not only just right now, it's my final year project, but it's also sometimes some family problems or maybe girlfriend problems or life just catches up into you you know and it, it made me think that why do I have to go through so much just because of a fucking trial but now that I think back I now I look back in retrospect that now is December right I'm glad I'm going through this right now as an amateur footballer rather than, than during my professional days if I become professional who knows but I'm taking this as a reality check. However, whatever I have faced this month, I mean last month, and I'm glad I got that reality check so, so early into what I would say is my football career. Is that a correct thing to say? But yeah, I thought about it and I realized, wow, I feel like shit. I can't focus on myself. I can't focus on football. I can't focus on anything. and so much on my plate. And that is without the expectations of anyone in the professional industry. Imagine when I become a professional, there's going to be more pressure. I'm going to be having me playing matches every week. I'm going to be training. I'm going to have to answer people, like interviews and all that, sponsorships and all that. I, have, I will have a lot to handle if I become a professional in that sense. So, compared to what I'm facing now, that is nothing lah, whatever I'm facing now, compared to what I think I'll face as a professional. And it's very tiring lah. After going through so much in November, and trust me, it's a lot. I've gone through so much in November to the point where I look back in my project and eventually I did get in the Woodland Warrior team but I didn't feel any form of satisfaction of whatever I've done not because I didn't think I've done enough but it's because life struck me so hard that I couldn't reap the fact that I have gotten in the team after trying to get in a, a proper maybe training team or official recognized him by the Football Association of Singapore for the longest time but somehow I didn't feel any satisfaction from it but I'll look in the bright side and since I'm not satisfied from it at least there's hunger on my side to improve as a person and yeah that's about it I'm really not having a good time and I got still got my final year project to complete. Don't worry, I have like at least two video ideas coming up already. Or even three. I'm I might post the 
preparation for the trials. I might still post it, but it's gonna take me a while uh, because I'm honestly in a very low point of my life. So yeah, thank you guys for your continuous support. Sorry for not posting much. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. No, that doesn't make sense. No, you, of course I'll see you guys in my next video. I mean, I hope that things will get better and I can post as normal again. Thank you guys for understanding if you have sat through to this part of the video. I doubt this video will get any views anyway, but fuck it man. I don't do it for the views. I do YouTube for myself, really. Yeah, that's about it.